Nanyang Technological University is stepping up to help firms commercialize their technologies. A new innovation facility will give them better access to technical expertise. Now, it hopes to give additional resources to create new higher quality ventures. These videos were generated from still pictures. The company is using artificial intelligence to quickly produce low-cost videos. However, taking its product to market was a challenge. We believe that we have the uh, innovation and R&D solution to have a breakthrough uh, capability for the industry. So the challenge is really getting the traction and getting the funding to place us into the next level of the game. Another NTU team is also facing similar hurdles in its attempt to address dementia. Its four clinically designed games test for specific cognitive and behavioral brain functions. These can detect the early stages of dementia. It has a near 90% accuracy and can be administered in 15 minutes. You can have an idea, you can have motivation to do things, but you do need support from people who believe in you and also to give you the foundation to do the right things. NTU's new facility will support such firms with a collaborative space to share resources and networks. The technologies developed by these startups will also be featured on a new website. One industry player says such a move is beneficial. It becomes a lot more transparent. So as soon as uh, it's published on a portal, we get notified, then we can check whether is that something that will help us build better products. Other institutes of higher learning such as the National University of Singapore will also jointly showcase its technology on the website. NTU believes local startups can benefit from such collaborations. We can lead the way to show other universities all around the world how universities should be marketing our intellectual property to the industry. Over the last three years, NTU saw 953 intellectual properties filed, a 70% increase compared to the previous three years.